Rigging Station. Brought to you by Diamond Fishing, the finest monofilament, fluorocarbon, and braided fishing line. Hi, and welcome to this episode's Rigging Station. You're watching Captain Carlos and I. We're aboard our 270Z, our mercury-powered CV Bay boat. We're in Charlotte Harbor targeting redfish and snook. Now, there's about a million different ways to fish for redfish. Top water plugs, soft plastics, heck, even a live shrimp under a popping cork. What we're doing here is we're fishing this long bar. It's this exposed bar. As this incoming tide comes in, the bar is going to flood, and these redfish come up on the bar to feed. And it seems like the best method here is just to soak some cut bait, some mullet and some ladyfish. And while it's very simple, certainly you've got to be rigged right in order to maximize on every opportunity. We're fishing seven foot, six inch chaos inshore graphite rods rated for eight to 17 pound line, super sensitive rod with a really nice soft tip, extra casting distance with that seven foot, six inch length, but plenty of backbone as well when you hook these big bull redfish. The rod is matched to a Daiwa size 4000 BG, a black and gold. This is the new version of the classic Daiwa black and gold reels. Really reliable, great all-around versatile spinning reel, and it's not gonna break the bank. We've got the reel loaded with fresh 10-pound diamond braid. Again, super strong, very, very sensitive. From there, about a 36-inch liter of 20-pound diamond presentation fluorocarbon. We've connected that fluorocarbon to the braid with a really small streamlined FG knot. I've been using this knot a lot lately, absolutely love it. It's incredibly strong when it's tied properly and incredibly streamlined. We finish off the rig in this particular case with just a jig head, nothing more than a jig head. It helps keep that cut bait anchored to the bottom. Make sure that that jig head though has a nice big wide gap hook. We connect that jig head with a small little loop knot. Very simple, just gives it maximum mobility. And I'll tell you what, like I said earlier, it's a simple rig, but it has to be done properly in order for you to achieve maximum success.